Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am super excited about today's video because I love to shop and also I have been like collecting this stuff for this haul for, I don't know, probably like two months. Um, so I've been dying to film it all and show you guys everything that I've picked up for the fall and winter season since I am in Southern California. I kind of like lump fall and winter together because the temperature is like this kind of the same for us. Let's see what do I have here? I've got like Zara, I've got some stuff from Nordstrom, some stuff from Nordstrom Rack, um, Cotton On, and I even have a few things from Misguided as well. But um, I think that's enough rambling for this video. Let's go ahead and get into the haul. Oh, also super quick, you guys, before I forget, if you like this makeup look, this fall-inspired makeup look, um, I did film it, so I will leave it linked down below um, if you are interested to check that out. Okay, that's all. Let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> okay, so the first thing that I want to start with is I just got two t-shirts from Cotton On. They were buy one, get one 50% off, I think. Okay, so yeah, one of them was $25 and the other was $20. And the one that was $20 is this really cute Led Zeppelin t-shirt. I love graphic tees like this. This is such a staple in my wardrobe, but I liked the color of this one and I don't really have a light blue one. So I thought that this one was super cool. And then the other one I got because I actually went on vacation to Disney World <laughs> with my mom and my sister and I saw this and I was like, oh my god. I have to have that. So it's a uh, Minnie Mouse as like a witch little t-shirt and it's like a navy. It looks kind of purple on camera but it's actually like navy. Okay and then I got from Zara this sweater. It was $45.90 so it's like a little up there I think for like a sweater from Zara but it's super super soft. So it's got this like really intense like turtleneck on it which I kind of loved and then it's like a cropped sweater. Also from Zara I bought a suit actually. I just thought it was so cute. So I actually saw it on Instagram. I just saw it and was like oh my god I have to have that because I love pink. That's my favorite color. It's got this belt on it, this fabric belt that matches and really like cinches in the waist and then it's just kind of like a regular like straight leg trouser. It's got pockets um in the side and this fabric it's like a pink and green plaid it's like mostly pink and then it's got this little bit of green running through it which i thought would be really fun as far as pairing so the bottoms are 49.90 so 50 bucks and they actually are made quite well so i feel like it's a good price and then the jacket is 69.90 so 70 bucks but it's got like shoulder pads in it. Like it's a pretty hefty blazer that I think will last a really long time. It's like a collarless style. And I just think it's really honestly nicely made. It's fully lined. Let's move on to Nordstrom Rack. So first up, I found these Seven for All Mankind jeans. Originally they were 185. I want to say I got them for somewhere around like 60 bucks. So they're this cropped wide leg pair of pants in this gorgeous mustard color oh my gosh you guys this color is so perfect these are the cropped alexa cropped trouser jean a lot of stretch to them they're gonna be super super comfy i also picked up some active wear um so these are by 90 degree by reflex so these ones i don't have the tag on them i don't remember how much i paid for them honestly but anyway i don't have the tag on them anymore because i've washed these and worn these so many times i'm obsessed with these they're super super soft they're super stretchy but like that kind of like holds you in active wear stretchy which is like my preference and the color this like light green color is just so cute and they've got the pockets on the sides which is like my new obsession okay so also some stuff i got from Nordstrom rack i got these nike leggings they're the dry fit and i'm sorry i also ripped the tag off these i already wore them um but they were like in the same price point so they're kind of like a I guess I would say like a teal kind of color. They're showing up super blue on camera. I'm like looking at the monitor over there right now. Um, and they're showing up really blue, but they're kind of like a greeny, like teal kind of color in person. Um, but yeah, I mean, just like some basic leggings. And then these I got for, I got them for less than this actually. So they were $14.95 is what the red tag says, but I'm pretty sure it was like when they were doing 25% off their clearance stuff. So it was like 25% off this red tag price. These are by Zella. And they're just, again, a little bike short in this 
uh, print here. These ones also have pockets on the side, which is great. Um, they're a good length, a little bit longer. Continuing with active wear, I also got this sports bra for $12.73 is what the tag says, but again, it's not red, red tag, so it was like 25% off that price, so it was a good deal. Okay, it was cheap. And this is Gotex brand. So it's just like a basic little like slip-on sports bra in like a light gray color. And it's got this cute crossed back. Okay, so then I splurged a bit on this piece and I'm so excited to wear this piece, you guys. So excited. Okay, so it's by Rag and Bone. It was $99.97, but again, it was the red tags and it's this 100% cashmere little short sleeve sweater in this gorgeous taupey brown kind of color. It's really thin because it's cashmere. It's still really warm even um, with like the short sleeve. But it is like a really thin, lightweight sweater, and it just honestly looked so good on. You guys will see it in the try-on clips. It just looks so cute that I literally couldn't pass it up, and it's super, super soft. I also ordered some stuff on Nordstrom.com. I got two basic little white tees. So this first one's kind of like a, I guess you could say like a baby doll style. It's got the little ruffle edge on the sleeves and on the hem, and it's a little bit cropped. This is like a slim fit. This is by the brand BP. It's super inexpensive. I wanna say it was like somewhere around like 10 bucks. And then I wanna say somewhere around like 15 or 20, actually I think it might've been 20, is this just Nordstrom brand, plain white V-neck tee. I will say like, it's really comfortable and it's really soft, but it's a little bit thinner than I wish it was it's not like the worst ever but um if you wear a nude bra with it like you're not going to see your bra through it but for me i have to be careful about which new bra i put it with because i have a couple where like the edge of the cup is kind of like rolling a little and so that will show through the t-shirt so also from bp i got another sweater vest i already own two <laughs> but i like really love them i want to say it was like 15 20 dollars again i'm sorry guys i ripped the tags off but it's like this olive green color and it's cropped. It's got these cute little buttons down the front, the v-neck. It's different than the ones that I have. Cause the ones that I have don't have like the buttons up the front. So that's why I got this one. Back to activewear. I got some stuff from the brand Zella. Um, so these leggings were $59. I really like the fabric of these. It feels super nice, but it's like this olive green color. The jacket was on sale, which is why I got the leggings. Normally these jackets I think are 98. Um, and I think it was just this specific color that was on sale, and I want to say it was maybe on sale for like 50 or 60 bucks, something around there. But honestly, the $98 is so worth it for this jacket, okay? Like if you work out or you just like activewear for like your everyday style, it does. But it's just got this little collar on it, it zips up the front, it's got little zip pockets on the side here. Um, and yeah, it's just like that stretchy, like it feels just like the leggings. It's the same color as the leggings. Um, it does have a little thumb hole, but I never use the thumb hole. I will probably buy this for the $98 in the black as well, because I love this for the fall and winter, like heading to and from the gym. More Nordstrom items. Okay, let's do, let's do these first. Um, I need to get these hemmed, okay? I'm just gonna tell you guys that right now. I'm gonna put them on with like my tallest shoes so you guys can get like the idea of what, like how they are, but they're too long on me. Um, so these are by Open Edit. They were $59. They are a pair of faux leather wide leg pants in this like gorgeous tan camel kind of a color. They've got an elastic waistband on them, which is super comfy. They've got pockets, which is great. Then they're just like this fabulous wide leg. Faux leather pants in particular have just been like, well, I mean, faux leather as a whole for fall has been so huge it's such a huge trend but especially um faux leather in like wider leg silhouettes like a straight leg trouser or something like that like that's so on trend right now and these are honestly super comfortable my one thing with them that is a qualm for me but will probably be fine for most of the rest of the country the back side of the faux leather is like this fleecy kind of material these are so warm i literally was just trying these on like in my studio space here where i film in my apartment where we have air conditioning and I was sweating. I had them on like literally with a tank top and I was sweating. I am a little worried about like how much wear I'm gonna be able to get out of these being in Southern California where it doesn't get that cold in like the fall winter. Like I could wear these in like the dead of winter or I could wear them like if I'm going out at night to get drinks with my friends or something like that. But 
it's kind of a bummer because I feel like I can only really wear them like dead of winter and maybe a couple times in fall like if it gets cool enough I don't know I'm a little worried that I'm not gonna be able to get as much wear out of those as I would like to but I am obsessed with them so I picked these up from Nordstrom but these are skims bodysuits this one was $58 I got two different styles so this one is like the it's supposed to be like the square neck style but honestly it's a little more like rounded on me but this white color is so cute um i definitely have to wear like a nude bra with it which is fine because that's why i got one with the thicker strap so that i could wear a bra with it so this is a size small and i'm usually an extra small like so yeah these definitely run small size up if you get them um but they are so stretchy here. and then i got this one and this one is not see-through i don't have to wear a bra with this because of the color of it um, it's the same material. It's the Fits Everybody range line fabric, if I remember correctly. Um, and they're super soft. Like, these are so comfortable to wear. Love those. Plan on getting more of those bodysuits in the future. I forgot uh, one thing from Nordstrom Rack. These were $99.97. These are Mark Fisher boots. These are in a size 8. And I have like a million pairs of boots. But <laughs> I only have one other pair of black boots. And... They've got like some other details on them. They're not like plain like this. So I really wanted just a plain sleek pair of Chelsea boots that I could wear every day. And these fit the bill. And um, they're normally like $200 um, full price, like full retail price. Ooh, we're almost through. I only have a few more pieces to go. The final pieces I have are from Misguided. But this is this little like fluffy green kind of a cardigan with the button front. It's super oversized. It's got these super oversized um, sleeves and the reason I got this was because I wanted a cardigan that I could wear as like a shirt. The other things I got from Misguided. So here's the thing, okay? Here's the thing. I don't know how much of this is going to still be available for purchase because all the stuff that I got are from the Misguided and um, Jordan Lipscomb collaboration. So I don't really know like what's still available and what's like sold out. So I'm sorry if I'm showing you things that you literally can't buy anymore. I basically bought this stuff as like my going out clothes now that we're slowly reaching the end of the pandemic. Like we're not there yet, but we're slowly approaching it. This dress that I've been waving around while I explain that whole thing, um, uh, you'll see it better in like the try on clip, but it's got this little like open part in the center. And it's got this little tie that you can either tie like in the front across that open section or you can like tie it around the waist in the back. Got some options. It's like super stretchy and it's really cute and I love this dot print. This is that same dot print but in like a mesh kind of a see-through top except it's lined in the little boobs box. And it's got this long ruched sleeve on it and it has this little tight bit down here. But that comes with this little matching skirt. Just like a little like ruched tube skirt type of thing fully lined. And it's got these little ties. I've got these pants. They're like a super stretchy knit flat pant and they're like a flared leg. They've got a little split in the bottom. And then at the waist, they've got two little like strappy bits. This top, which is a long sleeve and it's one of those ones where it just goes right under the boob. It's almost like a bra, um, like a bra cup kind of a style at the bottom. And then the back laces all the way up. And then you also have this like extra string here that you can tie around your waist. If it's still available, uh, any of those pieces, I will link them down below for sure. So that concludes my fall haul. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys saw some cute stuff, gave you some inspiration um, for how you might style some of some fall pieces and especially maybe some colorful fall because I had some fun colorful pieces in here. So hopefully that gave you guys some ideas. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave me a comment, let me know what your favorite piece was. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.